Oh, speaking of space. Oh, yeah. Speaking of space, this is actually pretty big news. Big news from a galaxy far, far away. Recently, thank you, Wookie. I'm not sure who that is out in the audience. Recently, we learned that Jurassic World director Colin Trevorrow is out as director of Star Wars Episode Nine. I believe we have a video of how he was fired. Oh, they always choke you on a Friday. <laughs> Lucasfilm has released a statement saying that they have mutually chosen to part ways with the director, while Colin Trevorrow released a statement saying, if you strike me down, I should become more powerful than you can possibly imagine. <laughs> then his robe just collapsed. It was weird. There's nobody there. <laughs> now, this turnover is just the latest indication that not all is well in that wretched hive of scum and villainy we call Hollywood. Because... It comes after Disney fired the directors of the young Han Solo movie and had to do expensive reshoots on Star Wars Rogue One. Plus, the ASPCA came down on them pretty hard for their treatment of Chewbacca. <laughs> In the arms of a Wookiee. <laughs> <far away, laughs> Sorry. And. Episode 9 is slated to come out in less than two years, so obviously Disney is scrambling to find a replacement director as fast as possible. We thought we'd help here at The Late Show by suggesting some people we thought would do a great job. First up, if there's one thing we can all agree on is the Star Wars films were missing 70s music and extended conversations about cheeseburgers. So get ready for Quentin Tarantino's Star Wars Episode 9, Everybody Shoots First. <laughs> of course, I'd watch that. I had to watch it. Of course, Tarantino can be a little polarizing, but everybody loves romantic comedy. So what about Nancy Meyer's Star Wars Episode Nine? What Wookiees want? <laughs> sometimes, sometimes the droids you were looking for were right in front of you the whole time. <laughs> but one director is really throwing his hat into the ring for this job, even going ahead and making his own trailer. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting a new take on Star Wars from the nihilistic German director of Fitzcarraldo and Grizzly Man, Werner Herzog. A long time ago in the galaxy far, far away, as far away as a mother's affectionate glance or the cold touch of your sobbing lover, the evil forced order seeks control of the galaxy, forgetting that the galaxy itself is not but the infinite void. This is the way of things. In the desert, there's nothing but suffering. Life cannot sustain here, but truly it cannot sustain anywhere. Death is inevitable, and in this we find comfort. Look, mosquitoes dancing on the carcass of infinity. Our agony lends us brilliance. I love this guy. He is a spunky little robot ball, and I like that. The searing cut of the lightsaber cannot compare to the unfeeling violence of our endless universe. Star Wars Episode 9. Why do we need a subtitle when 100 years from now each of us will be dead buried in the cold dark ground? <laughs>